you an artist from Rio de Janeiro? I'm Elena. I come from Italy. I'm Ido. I'm a journalist based in Israel. I'm Silvia from Italy and I'm an environmental freelance journalist. Hello, I'm Stevan and together with other environmental journalists, I am the part of Climate Mosaic News Network. You've probably heard before that climate change is said to have all sorts of impacts around the world and governments are working to address this challenge. But what does it mean from the local point of view? I am in the middle of beautiful forest in Bosnia and Herzegovina, which was attacked this summer by insect bark beetle, damaging leaves and decreasing tree volume increment. And this is not happening for the first time. Some experts pointed out that climate change and temperature rising could be the reason of insect outbreak. Recent studies say that in the next 50 to 100 years, climate change will seriously put at risk the cultivation of typical products here in Tuscany, grapevines and olive trees. Experts say that if nothing is done, sea level rise could endanger Israel's coastal infrastructure and could also damage archaeological sites. Weather in Brazil may become hotter 6 degrees in the century and that means precipitation will fall dramatically, putting at risk biodiversity and water supply. The low-income population will be the first to suffer with the impacts of climate change and people living on the coast are as well vulnerable. The sea level rise in the Venice Lagoon the threat for biodiversity in the Mediterranean region and the glacier retreat in the Alps are just a few examples. With the CNN project, we want to change that. In November, government officials from around the world will be gathering in Warsaw, Poland to negotiate ways to tackle climate change. And we will be there and in the US, and Mali and Germany and Brazil and Nigeria and some other places around the world. In fact, the Climate News Mosaic live blog is where we will be sharing snippets of our reporting to highlight local perspectives on the global climate talks. In turn, these inputs will be incorporated in the um, reporting that we do individually for our media back home. What's more, during the Climate Summit, we will also be holding live Google Hangouts with some of our team members to keep you all posted about the latest developments in, in the talks and what they look like from around the world. And we want you to be part of this. Your donation can really help us realize this project and change the way climate change is reported in the media. We hope you join us. Toda. Grazie. Hvala vam.